Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Wasteland 3 Where last time we built our warbot, we went through the whole foundry And uh, built the warbot, we also uh, helped the fire expert Keith, Keith Or fire suppressant, suppression expert Keith uh, And now we're ready to go blast through the door and probably kill Ludlow because he's a dick Oh, it's beautiful Hey, you did it. I thought you guys were never coming back. This is great. You good to start cutting? Because I'm ready to end this. We're ready. Great. Now here's the plan. Aim that laser at the door and start cutting. When it's open, me and the bots will go in first with you covering us. Then you follow. Shoot anybody that resists. But Crow is mine. Rangers, before we proceed... The Warbot is programmed to respond to threats automatically. If we bring it into the Foundry, it will use lethal force against anyone who threatens us, which would go against Administrator Markham's wishes. If you want to keep the option for non-lethal measures open, I can disable the Warbot after it blasts through the door. Shall I? Disable it. We need to be able to limit our attacks to disruption weapons. Very well. I have programmed it to remain inert after it opens the blast door. Now oh, you bunch of pussies. Whatever. Okay, dude. God damn. That's one hell of a laser. That looks hot. Can we cool it down a little bit? Oh, it cools down pretty quickly. Good. We're going in. Cover us. Confront Crow in the foundry. Okay. Ludlow, you son of a bitch! We said we wouldn't open this door to anybody but Markham! You lost your chance to talk to Markham when you started this shit, you fucking vandal. We started it? Who's the one who charged us by the minute to visit our families? Who made us pay for first aid? You've been robbing us blind, motherfucker. You're getting fat off our misery. So I don't deserve something for breaking the rules for you? The computation engine says no one leaves the factory till quotas are met. It says one bathroom break per shift. What's wrong with taking a small fee to let you ignore that bullshit? What a humanitarian! Making a bad situation worse so you can profit off of it. And now, you're bringing in hired guns to kill us for striking against it all. How can you assholes stand with that creep? Uh, we're not standing with anybody. Markham told us to make things right down here, no matter what, no matter who was behind the trouble. Don't try that moral high ground stuff on us. We saw how your people were wrecking the factory. We're not with them. We saw his robots attacking workers in the factory. Yeah, we're not with them. Hey, I just told them to get things moving again. I didn't tell him how to do it. You can't pin that on me. That's bullshit and you know it, Ludlow. A robot doesn't do anything you don't tell it to. At least we got some mercy from you guys. You didn't kill any of my people. Unlike asshole here. Enough bickering. Ludlow, tell us your side of this. You want to talk, Crow? Tell. Or talk. Tell us your side. Uh, I mean, we kind of know the sides already, but we'll go through it. Ludlow. Everything was fine until this bitch started acting up. We had a smooth system going. We took care of the workers, and the workers took care of us. Uh, when I say us, I mean the factory, right? Everybody was happy. A smooth system for getting you paid, Ludlow! Shut your trap, Crow. All of a sudden, she starts getting the workers mad about stuff that wasn't a problem before. Breaks aren't long enough, food ain't good enough. Wants extra pay for double shifts. And when I try to tell her the gangs are coming, and if she goes on strike, she's gonna get us all killed, the crazy cow starts smashing up the place and saying that it makes the perfect time to strike. After that, the gloves were off. That's because us workers know the only time the bosses will lift a finger to save our lives is when theirs are on the line. You want to talk, Crow? Talk. Tell us your side. Hey, 
told you. I was helping you out. Giving you a way around Markham's rules. For a small fee, of course. Fuck off, you slime. We don't even know if they are Markham's rules. Because the one thing we couldn't pay you to do was take our grievances upstairs. No amount of money was enough to get us a face-to-face -face with the boss, was it? The boss doesn't need to be bothered with your petty bullshit. Particularly when we need to be cranking out warbots and turrets to protect ourselves from the coming of the gangs. She gave me the authority to handle you. And you abused that authority! You beat my workers half to death when we went on strike. You put Danny Chan's hand in the hydraulic press. He'll never work again! All right then, Crow. What are your demands? Simple. Get rid of Ludlow. Let us see our families. And we get back to building the gear that'll protect us all from the gangs. We won't even bitch about having to sleep in the factory until the end of the push. Don't listen to her. You give her an inch, she'll take a mile. It'll never end with her. Not until she runs the damn place. And if that happens, the plane's gangs will steamroll us. Ludlow, how can we help you make things better? You can start by arresting Crow. Once she's gone, the rest of the workers will calm down. Once they do, I'll forget the whole thing. They can go back to work like nothing happened. No recriminations, no revenge. I'm not a guy to hold a grudge. That does not sound true. <laughs> okay, if you believe that, I have a palace in Broadmoor Heights I want to sell you. Once I'm gone, you can bet everybody who stood with me will get the axe. One way or the other. Thanks for your input. We've made our decision. Oh, yeah? Oh, boy. I can't wait. Sorry, Ludlow. It looks like you're the problem. For the good of the factory and the workers, you're under arrest. The workers' concerns are legitimate, but your methods aren't helping, Crow. You're coming with us. The only way things are getting going to get better here is if both of you are out of the picture. You're both under arrest. <laughs> uh, Ludlow, you're under arrest. Like hell I am. Nobody runs this place but me. Robots, kill these fucking mercs. Uh, Die, can you over overrule that? I guess not. Hey, music. It's been a while since we've had music, I feel like. Uh, do another one. Why isn't it uh, affecting these guys? Oh, Jesus, there's a lot of them. Get here. Prepare. Aspect. Go ahead and go up to this guy. Um, go ahead and get right here, Chasm. Fire. Prepare. Slayer. Hmm. Move here. Oh, that doesn't kill them. I think we need to sw switch to lethal then. Calm down, valued employees. Yikes, that's a lot of, uh, dog bots. Bow wow. I like it. Luckily, it doesn't look like they do a lot of damage. That's nice that they hit, uh, lead though, there, too. Where are you running to, lead though? Ow. Thank you. 
Okay. Oh, that's nice. Thanks, Chief. Where are you going, die? Alright, switch to the flame saw chain saw. Or cannon. I have you move right here. Take these guys down. Defend. Alright, aspect. Got the dud though. I was hoping you'd be able to finish him. Defend yourself. Chasm, can you hit Ludlow? Hmm. Go here. Hopefully we still have the shot here. It's actually really good. Okay, that doesn't kill him. Switch to lethal. And you miss? That's not good. Oh, come on. That's like the worst 69 ever. Guys, it going all over the place. Ow. That was very painful. God, there's so many of them. What the fuck? If we have to reload, we'll obviously be starting off with lethal damage. Okay. They have so many attacks, too. It's ridiculous. How did he die? Okay. Switch weapons. Attack him. Better than nothing. That did nothing as well. Okay. I think we just lost. The so Slayer is going to have to get the chasm. Why are there so many dogs? Holy crap. have so many attacks. Maybe, um, Aspect will have to get Chasm up. I don't know. Okay. 
Gotta do something, Crow. That was not good enough. Man, this is a tough fight here. Ludlow has a ton of health. Wait, what? We can't move? Okay, we gotta reload. Uh, okay. Yep, we can't have people die, so. And it's not just, it's really not just about like having three people is gonna make combat even harder. A lot of it has to do with, really? It didn't save when we, okay. Is that really the last save? That's terrible auto saving, but okay. Uh, I'll be back once we get to the fight. All right, guys, we're back. Back in the fight here. We've got all the lethal weapons ready. And let's go ahead, start off with a nice... Nah, I'm not gonna start with that, actually. Start off with a rally. If I move right here, can fire at him. There we go. Defend. Aspect. Go after the guard bot. Defend. Chasm. Right here. You're gonna ambush. And Slayer. Hmm. Come over here. Set an ambush up over here. Good shot. Yeah, it's already a 10 on that. Wow. <laughs> they go for the person furthest away. It's just, I don't like it. They just summon more of them, huh? Why didn't she get an ambush off on anybody? I, sh I feel like she should have got a shot off on those guys. Oh well. God damn, that's a lot of people. A lot of bots around him. Her. Really? That's who you go after? Stop marking people, just fire. That's good. Damn, you've taken some damage. All right, thunder. Not FAP for that. Got a third grenade right there. And defend. Hmm. 
Good. Bad. Oh my god. Move here. Fire. Uh, we're not getting like any luck here. It's just these dogs. Why are they so strong? And why are there so many of them? I don't, if I had nerd stuff, I guess this would make it things a lot easier, but it's ridiculous. I wonder if we took the, the war robot with us if they attacked just our enemies. Because it doesn't look like we can non-lethally kill this guy. So... It might be better just to bring him with him. With us. Good. Good. Friendly turn. Gonna cower. Okay. Nobody can go. Aspect killed in action. God damn it, dude. This is. I feel like this is potentially the biggest thing we've seen so far where only having four people is affecting us because everybody just gets 10 stacks of that disruption so quickly. All right, uh, got to go through this whole conversation again now. Fucking a, you did it. I thought you We're ready. If you want to keep it active. Good choice, Rangers. And hopefully it sides with us. It would suck if it sides with blood, though. You would think we made it so it answers to us since we built it, though, right? I hope. And if that happened, <laughs> oh boy, like hell I am. Okay. It's still yellow, so it's with us at least. All right, we're gonna rally. Move here and just ambush. Um, we need to get these guys. Just ignore Ludlow for now. Go this side. Got to kill these dogs. I should have put it, put a deployable out, but move over here. Good. Defend. Yeah, we're going to ambush here. Enemy turn. Good. Ooh, almost killed that one. Never been good. But he's almost dead. That's that's a bonus for us. Already at plus six there. Plus nine. Plus 10 already, so he's she's already stuck, and she's dead. That's... 
What an annoying thing. So many guard dogs. It's... <laughs> Or dog bots, whatever you want to call them. Cool. And Crow does absolutely nothing here. It makes me want to just attack her. Oh god, that doesn't do shit. Get Chasm up. Go hide. Cause she's gonna go down once the dog attacks there. God damn it, man. Ah, oh, these dogs are so strong. It's insane. We're not going to be able to get to Aspect. She's going to die again because she's too far away. I'm pretty sure Slayer is the only one that could have reached her. Hey, there's some good damage. Maybe we just need to, like, let her tank things and hold back. I don't really know. Oh, our warbout's gone. It did nothing. Okay. All right, Thunder can get the aspect. Good. Might as well just prepare. Both of you. Um. Move there. Killed one of them. Good, they're all going over there. Yeah, I guess having Crow tank is what we need to do. Hopefully this guy doesn't shoot at us. Fantastic. Now's our chance to fight 
Could you do it where you can hit more people? You only got one attack there. And you're ambushing? Why? Don't ambush. Do something. Ugh. The bear's useless. Oh, no, move here. Defend. Go grab her. We got this. Ooh, lucky action. That's good. Good. And heal yourself. Uh, ambush, I guess. Okay. We might, we might be able to recover here. We're all very low health, though. Aspect's gonna go down. They're gonna shock her to death. Hey, got a shot. It's good that they're going after them. Uh-oh. Another one? Fuck, oh, Jesus Christ. Where are you going? No, go that way. Good, now come over here and do that with the dogs. Where are you? Ah, oh, they're so dumb. There's look at all these guys. Let's see how you like it. And this guy's done nothing. It's like his first shot. Gotta go get her up. Might as well. That didn't do a whole lot, but hey. I don't know, run over here. Up and at him, ladies. Go there, hit the CPU. I'll take it. Chasm. Run away. I hope nobody hits you. Oh my god. This, uh, this, I hate this so much.
really not a fan of this at the moment. There we go, that'll at least make it so we don't die too quickly. Uh, we have nobody who can use the MP grenades. Let's get the plasma grenades. Um, deployables. Let's get some laser turrets. Be using those. Grab those. I don't know, maybe we should be eating some food too. I don't know. Or some drugs. Sorry, have some stir fried pork ready to go. Okay. Save it. Let's try again. Fucking A, you did it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you want to. I didn't mean to disable it. It didn't really provide much help for us anyway. I mean, our best attempt was with the disruption weapons, so maybe maybe that was doing something that I wasn't noticing. Maybe it affected the their ability to do damage. Like the robots. I don't know. It wasn't... It wasn't stopping them, but maybe it. You son of a. How can you ask? More than they fucking deserved. That's because of. The... And you abused them. And if that happened. <laughs> oh boy. All right, let's do this. Nobody... Are you crazy? Robots. Kill me. So, start with that. Throw a plasma grenade right there. There we go. Can you do another one? Do another one. Good. Aspect, come over here. Start hitting these guys. I don't know. Maybe we need to go after them so they don't spawn more of those bots. Chasm, you're gonna come over here. Go into Overwatch or Ambush. And then move you over here. You're gonna go into Ambush too. Lucky evade. There we go. They have so many attacks. It's insane. That's so dumb. Ugh. I guess that's okay. It would have been better if you were over here, but...
Some damage, finally. Okay, Thunder, you're gonna move over here. Throw a grenade right there. And another. Defend. Chasm, go get her up. And then you're gonna move back under cover. And fire a dart at her. Good. Prepare. I guess go right here. Get more cover from the sniper. Okay. Uh, there's so much going on. They're moving around so much. Oh, he died. Perfect. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yep, this is all fair. This is fair. Okay. I don't even... So stupid. This does not feel like a very fun fight. I don't even know why I haven't reloaded yet. Oh yeah, you don't have any turns. You know, maybe I need to look to see if there's armor that resists this stuff. understand why she's not dying here. I thought they, like, did massive amounts of damage. Oh, we're resisting it, I think. I don't know. Okay. 
We're just stunlocked, so I'm gonna reload now. Because eventually they are going to kill her. Oh my god, this fight. It is not very fun. I'm sure I'm missing something. There's probably some sort of thing I should be doing that's... That counters that, but... I don't know what it is. Maybe one of their armor types? Resistance to shock, but I don't think it's shock damage, is it? Status effect resistance. That might be what we need. Hmm. It's not gonna... I guess it would be useful, but I don't know. Um... Okay. Let's try this one more time. Keep the robot active. And instead of sending Aspect into the fray immediately, we'll set up two laser turrets to try and do some damage on things too. And um, I think the plasma grenades were good. But we need more of them. Maybe I should have given them to, to Slayer too. And I don't know what we're going to do about the sniper. About Ludlow. I'm guessing we need to get Aspect up in front of him. Okay. They're gonna do a rally. We are gonna start off with these. Again. And again. Get a crit. Aspect. Alright, laser turret. Over here. Laser turret over here. Might as well throw a machine turret up here too. For no other reason than to distract him a little for a little bit. Chasm over here. Overwatch. Come over here. Ambush. All right, let's see. See how things shape up. That was decent. Good. At least one robot's going after that. There we go. Chasm, my hero. Thank you. Finally. All right. So far, so good. Nobody's dead. Yet. Friendly turn. Where are you going, man? Why after him? <laughs> oh, jeez, he's gonna die. Good. I appreciate it.
It does do decent damage, this Warbot. I shouldn't have discounted it. It just goes down quickly. If you could just throw a yellow snowball right at, um... Him, that'd be great. Right here. Another. All right. Where else can you throw one? Right here. Do that. Do a little bit more damage over there. Aspect. It's time for you to get up in his face. Got the poison on him. That's good. Do you have a shot on anybody? No. Go ahead and mark him. Go into ambush mode again. Slayer, come over here. Start trying to take this guy down. Hold on, cancel that. CPU. Good. Defend. Good damage there. Enemy turn now. Perfect. Okay, so Aspect's going to be stunned. Hopefully this guy lives. Come on, dude. Nope. Aspect's down. Fuck you. I hate you. This would be great if it stuns him. That's fantastic. There you go. Do that more often. Oh, you should have killed him. Friendly turn. Good damage over there. Okay, die is pretty useless here. Okay, thunder. Do this. We can get these kills, or at least some of them. Uh, it's not going to kill any of them, but they'll be close. Go ahead and go over here, and hopefully you don't die. You can kill the dog bot. Move up here. Come on, get the kill. Good. That's good. Defend. Damn, almost got a kill up there. That would have been good. Okay. Don't you die, die. 
self repair over there. Jesus. Feels like that was a bit much. Good. No, just attack. Come on, Chief. Kill this guy. No, you have to reload. Ah. Uh, Venters. All right, get him up. Um, move here. Attack him. Good. You're gonna move over here. And just defend yourself. Okay, you're going to kill him. Go up here and get him. And then... Go for the body. Damaged armor, good. Aspect. Just get some cover. And defend. Good. Good. All right, I think we're gonna be okay. No, not another one. Goddamn guard bots. Extra large. This is good that we're keeping Ludlow stunned. And did a little damage there, too. Come on, friendlies. Keep going. Good. Ooh, that's really good. Can you go smack somebody? Oh, stop cowering. Hit. It's terrible. Uh, yeah, start moving around the warbot. Aspect. Come up here, start smacking him. He's stunned, come on. There you go, every little bit counts. Defend yourself. Uh, Chasm, move up here. Okay, okay. Thank the Lord. Take it easy for a second. You want the factory to fail so bad? Crow can have it. Oh, man, that was... We just had to hit him, I guess. We just had to kill him, so that was a way around everything. But we did good. We did good. Now what's it gonna be for me? Don't suppose I'm uh, free to go, huh? Uh, we've got a nice cell for you back at Ranger HQ. Fuck. Guess it beats getting dead. It does. This is Ranger HQ Actual. Come in, Team November. We've got Carl Ludlow in custody. Send a team to take him into holding. Carl Ludlow's in chains. Send a team to toss him in, a, in the brig. Yeah, we've got him in custody. Team in route, November. Ranger HQ out. There we go. Thanks for taking out Ludlow. I don't think we would have beat him by ourselves. You would not have. Now, are you going to take our demands to Markham, or are we going to have to do this dance all over again? What's your story? Just another refugee from the Eastern Plains. You know, farm burned, folks killed, taken by slavers. A thousand people around here with the same story. Only difference is... I got an ornery streak in me. I fought back. Killed my owners, escaped, came here. Thought things were gonna be better. And for a while, they were. Got hired at the factory, started getting paid. 
But then the conditions got worse, and Ludlow got hired and started stealing our wages. Suddenly, it was pretty much slavery again, and well, I wasn't gonna stand for that. Guess you know the rest. What led to the uprising? Like I said, Ludlow was the tipping point, but things were already getting weird. Markham started relying on her computation engine to make all her decisions, setting 14-hour shifts, hiring people based on these crazy tests. And that's how I got hired. I mean, here's me with my history of killing former employers, and the test said I had an obedient personality. <laughs> I was glad to get the job, but what the hell? Only a computer would think putting a born shit stirrer like me in a slave pit and hiring a gaping asshole like Ludlow to watch over me was a good idea. What do you think of Markham? She's smart. At least she was. Built Steeltown up from nothing. Made it a place where just about anybody could get a job and do okay. Now though, well, if she's not careful, it's gonna blow. Everybody hates her these days. Her employees, the refugees she won't hire, the families of the workers who are trapped inside. I don't know what she thinks she's doing, letting that computer make all her decisions for her. But it ain't working. Maybe somebody else needs to be in charge. Okay, we'll talk to Markham for you. Thank you. That's all we wanted from the beginning. But, fair warning, if she doesn't meet our demands soon, we'll bring this place to its knees. Go give her an ear. All right, let's loot. Oh man, that was a really, really frustrating fight. It was tough for me. Uh, a lot of energy cells and energy weapons and robotic parts. As you'd expect. All right, what else do we have in here? A large container. We'll take all of that. Vehicle part unlocked. Disruption field grenade launcher. Nice. Toaster repair over there. Don't need that. Medical crate and ammo box over here. Take that and take that. There we go. Let's go down here. Kind of wish I'd killed the low, to be honest, but yeah, we should have killed them. Is it over? The strike? Ellen? Yes, things should start getting back to normal. Uh, who are you? Name's Ellen. I'm a data processor. I was down here pulling punch cards from the Warbot line. Filling in for my pal Bishop when everything went hinky. Hid in a closet. When things quieted down a minute ago, I decided to see what's what. It should be safe to leave now. Oh, sounds good. Say... You must have come into Steel Town pretty recently. Oh. Did you happen to see my daughter outside? Her name's New. Son of a bitch. Sorry, Ellen. She died trying to make it through the ducks to bring you your medicine. She's... She's dead? Oh, Newt. Brave little. I... Thank you for telling me. But please leave me be. Man, I'm terrible. I am just the worst, aren't I? All right, we're going to end the episode there, guys, on that cheery note. Um, in the next episode, we'll go talk to Markham and see what uh, we're going to do about the gangs and the rest of the factory. But until then, I hope you all have a wonderful day, and I'll catch you later.